Howdy partners, it's your boy John here. Welcome back to Pokemon Yellow. Last time we left off, we finally made it into Pewter City. Uh, today, I'm kind of tempted to just spend some time trying to level up Flutters here. Uh, Flutters is going to be the main one, I think, for the Pewter City gym. Uh, she... I think she'll do okay against... I, I think Flying was strong against Rock and Ground, which... This gym is a rock type, but there's a guy in here who has a sand shoe, so I might just... Let's go ahead and head in. Let me look at here real quick. Do I have any... I've got one potion. Might be worth going to get another one. Hiya! I can tell you! Have what it takes to become a Pokemon champ! I'm no trainer, but I can tell you how to win. Let me take you to the top, sure. Alright, let's get happening. It will be tough for your Pikachu at this gym. Electric attacks are harmless to Brock's ground type Pokemon. Okay. Well. Um. Let's start off by taking on this guy here. See what Flutters can do. If it doesn't go too well, I'll probably go um, spend some time trying to level her up. I think he has a Sandshrew. Oh, wait. I think that was only in red. Oh, he has a Diglett. Okay, I think Flutters will do okay against uh, Diglett here. Let's just start spamming Gust. Yeah, that, that's a pretty good against him. I probably should uh, throw down a couple sand attacks. Might want to actually do that. Right, hit, hit him with a sand attack. Alright, hopefully we can tank another hit. Alright, he misses. Alright, let's get rid of this Diglett. I'll probably throw down a potion. Uh-huh. Go to level 9. Okay. About to use Sandshrew. Okay, I was right. He did have a Sandshrew. Let's keep Flutters out, but we're going to throw down a potion on her real quick. Alright. Alright. Scratch. Hit it with a sand attack. Alright. And then a gust. Oh, okay. This is actually going to be a little tougher here. Uh, hit it with another gust. I might throw another sand attack at it. Mm, okay, hit it with another sand attack. This uh, isn't nearly as effective as I was hoping. At least we're kind of blocking the uh, scratch attacks he's trying to throw down at us. Uh, hopefully... Okay, hmm... Maybe I should have gone with another sand attack. Alright, hold it. We, we can do it. Just one more gust. Alright. We barely made it through that one. So, Flutters, I think, will do okay against Brock, but we should probably get some more, um... Potions. Definitely need some more potions. I'd say probably four should do it here. Light years isn't time. It measures distance. Okay. I just got 180 Poke Coins for winning. How you doing? Okay. All right, let's go um, heal up Flutters real quick, and then uh, hmm, probably go buy a bunch of. Well, well, I think does Brock's Onyx no wrap? If it does, we might want to get some Paralyzed Heals too. Well, okay, we'll probably get some Paralyzed Heals just to be on the safe side. We'll have to see how this goes. I might end up having to spend some time trying to level uh, up um, Flutters a little more. But I think she'll be okay. Just check over here at the Pokemart real quick. May I help you? Oh, no. Don't need any Pokeballs. I need some... Let's grab four potions. 
And do you have any paralyzed skills? I'll get two just to be on the safe side. I could be wrong, but I, I think I think it knows bind or wrap. One, one of those two. And uh, I think that has a chance of paralyzing. So to be on the safe side. Oh, what happened there? Be on the safe side. We're going to go ahead and um, go in with some paralyzed heals. All right. Let me just take a quick look here real quick. Uh, Flutter is level 10. Uh, speed stat is the best one. Sand attack, I think, is going to be very useful in this fight. We just can't let her get down too low in health. Believe it or not, rock hard, defense, and determination. That's why my Pokemon are all the rock type. Do you still want to challenge me? Fine then, show me your best. Okay. Brock wants to fight. It's going to start with the Geodude, I think. Um, what's going to be the best way to go here? I think I want to hit it with a Sand Attack to start off with. The extra speed set is definitely going to come in handy. It's going to come out with a Tackle. Ooh, okay, that's actually a little stronger than I thought it would be. Let me just test Gust here. Oh, that's not nearly as strong as I thought. Okay, we could be in trouble here. We could be in some trouble. Uh... Do I want to waste a potion now? Alright, we're gonna... No. I'm gonna hit him with a sand attack. Oh, that didn't help at all. Alright, now we need the potion. I was hoping... That the sand attack would be enough to get us some kind of advantage here. Oh, okay, we... Might hit him again with another sand attack. Just to make sure... Oh, he still got off a hit. Okay. It might be a good idea, when it comes to this fight, to uh, actually... get Bob involved, but after he becomes a Butterfree. Because otherwise... I don't think we'll stand much of a chance. Uh, if we get Bob, level up to a Butterfree, get him to have something like Poison Powder or Sleep Powder. I think we'll be able to handle this pretty well, but otherwise we'll be in trouble. We just need something that will continuously chip away at their health. So poison powder, I think, is going to be the best way to go. Uh, I throw in another potion here. I think we're doing actually pretty good now because that sand attack seems to definitely. Definitely be helping us out here. He can't get a good hit on us. So this is just going to be a really long fight, though. That's the problem, and I'm a little concerned about that. In fact, let me take a look here. Uh, tw uh, we you'll be fine. I think you'll have more than enough to finish off Geodude and then move on to um, Onyx. Oh, he got a tackle off. All right. His accuracy is still pretty bad now, so I'm, I'm just going to keep spamming it with, uh... Ooh. Keep spamming Gust. I might have, probably should have gotten a little bit, a few more, uh, potions. Yeah, I should have gone with more potions in this. Number with the sand attack. All right, we get rid of him, and I'm going to have to hit up Flutters one more time with a uh, potion. Hmm. All right, hit it one more time. Hopefully that's enough to take it out. No! Okay, we could be in trouble. Oh, no, we missed. Okay. Uh... Hit it with more gust. As soon as Onyx comes out, we're going to throw down the uh, potion. Okay, level 11. Brock is about to use Onyx. Will Ash change Pokemon? I'm kind of tempted. I'm kind of tempted to throw Bob in. I don't know why. 
I'm gonna throw Bob in. Let him take a little bit of a hit, and then um, hopefully that'll make it a little easier for us to get Flutters healed up a little bit. All right, let's go with the potion. I'm gonna throw it down on Flutters. Not quite enough. Uh, Screech, you know what? Bob, you might actually come in handy here. Let's go with a string shot. Hopefully that does. Oh, you're. Oh wait, your defense is pretty decent. So we're just going to keep it in it with a string shot. Although I think Flutters, Flutters definitely has a better speed stat than the Sonics. I think. But any advantage I can gain, I'll take it. In fact, let's let's just do a little bit of damage to him. Any kind of damage I can get. Oh, he used Bide. Okay. Well, that shouldn't be too bad. No, it's not too bad. Alright, that's the move I was thinking of. Bind. It has a chance to paralyze, I think. Alright. I'm kind of curious about something. Let me look at Watson real quick. Do you know any moves that would do anything good against him? Well, you have Tail Whip and Growl, which could come in handy against him. But if I do that, this battle will just go on and on and on. And I don't think I really want it to go too long, to be honest. Um, Alright, we'll just keep chipping away with uh, Bob here. I might actually pull Bob out here pretty fast if it get, his health gets too low. And, um... Alright, hopefully that doesn't knock him out. Oh, it does. Okay. I was kind of hoping to get Bob leveled up and evolved in sometime soon. Either this episode or next. Uh, hit him with a sand attack. Right, let me just test this. How does Gust do against him? Oh, no. Okay. So this is not going to go well for us. <laughs> Unless I keep hitting him with a sand attack. I hit him one more time with a sand attack, and then we'll just go to work. I, I, don't, I think Screech has a 100% chance of hitting anyway, so... Alright, I'm going to... You know what? I'm going to hit Watson, throw Watson out. Uh, see if I can kind of take down this guy's defense a little bit. I think... Let's go with Tail Whip. I think that'll help to lower his defense. Let's just keep doing that. I think this is actually going to be a good idea. I, I know it's kind of boring. But I think this is the way to go. I don't think Thunder Wave could do it. No, Thunder Wave is an electric type move, so it won't be able to hit Onyx. Alright, let's do it one more time. We'll switch uh, Flutters back in. And see how this goes. I'm going to hit him again with a Sand Attack. Just to make sure... Can't get any more hits off on us. Never mind. Got to hit off anyway. Alright, let's hit him with a gust. See how this does now. That's a little better, but not by much. I don't think we can pull this off. I think I used up all my potions, didn't I? I think I did. Alright, just start hitting him with a sand attack again until that passes. Oh, no! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, that was actually... Oh, wait, no, that just means when he... Uh... Right, Flutters, you're in trouble. I, I did not mean to do that. Alright, we're just going to hit him with a sand attack. No more mistakes. Do 
Do I have any more potions? No, I don't. Alright. Alright, we're good. As long as he doesn't use a tackle. I think we got this. Alright. One more. There we go! Alright, that wraps that one up pretty nicely there. Not very effective. Enemy Onyx fainted. Flutters gained 138 points. We're to level 12. Alright. Flutters might end up evolving before Bob. Well, no, no, no. Pidgey evolves at level 16, doesn't he? Uh, attack 17. Okay, speed stat is very good. Flutters learn quick attack. Okay, Watson gained 138. Go to level 11. Watson is trying to learn quick attack. Uh, but Watson can't learn more than four moves. Uh, let's see here. I'll probably get rid of Growl. Tail Whip is coming in handy. That was definitely a big part of this battle, so let's just get rid of Growl. Watson forgot Growl and learned Quick Attack. Alright. Ash defeated Brock. I took you for granted. As proof of your victory, here's the Boulder Badge. Ash received the Boulder Badge. Okay. Uh, he'll, he'll give us a Bide. I don't know who I want to give Bide to. I might give it to Flutters. I think that might be something, um, hmm. I think that might be a good idea. Or hold on to it. It's an official Pokemon League badge. It spares Pokemon become more powerful. The Technique Flash can now be used anytime. Ash got one, uh, what? 1,188 Poke Coins for winning. Wait, take this with you. Ash received TM34. TM contains a technique that can be taught to Pokemon. Your team is good only once, so when you use a, a one, when you use one to teach a new technique, pick the Pokemon carefully. TM34 contains Bide. Okay. Absorb damage in battle, then pay it back double. I don't think um, I don't think Flutters is the one I want to teach that to. I might save it for Bulbasaur when we get Bulbasaur. Um, I think that's gonna be the way to go. All right, let, let's uh, go heal up the team real quick. That actually went a lot better than it, I thought it would. I was expecting us to have to uh, go back twice to fight Brock. Because um, that's how it went last time I played this game. Uh, well, I played Red here on the channel, and it took me two tries to beat him. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. We heal your Pokemon back to perfect health. Okay, we'll need your Pokemon. Fine. Let's go ahead and heal up. I was actually expecting this video to go longer. Uh, let me let me just see how long I've been recording here. Okay, that's not too bad. I can probably go a little bit longer here. Uh, your Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again. Well, I don't know what else to do now. I, I guess I could spend some time trying to level up uh, Bob. So I might work on that. He just needs two more levels to evolve. I might just do that off screen then. Get a little bit extra things going on here in the episode. Let me just check around down here. Well, I've been spending a little bit of time leveling up Bob here. Um, he just got... He only has a little bit left to go. And I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly, Metapod evolves at level 10. Uh, so I might actually save that for next episode. Anything to do here before we actually call? I might actually just let's go look at the pewter museum I don't think there was really anything here at this point in the game uh, Later in the game after you get your fossil uh, Pokemon fossil you can come back here to uh, Get a Almanite or a Kabuto. And I think there's also a uh, old amber here, which gives you Aerodactyl I think you know, I might be getting things confused. <laughs> oh, no, 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 wait, wait, hold on. The um, place you get the Omnite and the Kabuto is on Cinnabar Island. This is where you get the old Amber. Okay, I remember now. 50 Poke Coins for a child's ticket. Would you like to come in? Sure. Yeah, so I I'm getting it mixed up. This is not where I get the fossil. Oh, this is where I get the fossil. It's not where I revive it. We got here. 
That's Aerodactyl. Primitive and rare Pokemon. Kabutops, fossil, a primitive and rare Pokemon. I'm trying to decide which one I'll, I'll want to get. Um, I think it was the Dome fossil that gets you Kabuto, and the Helix fossil gets you the Omanyte. Uh, I think Omanyte was the one that had the better defense stat, and Kabuto had the better attack stat. I think that's how it went. Meteorite that fell on Mount Moon. Moonstone? Question mark. Space Shuttle, Columbia. Fascinating. I'd like to get that Pikachu off you, but it's too attached to you. I want a Pikachu. It's so cute. He asked my daddy to catch me one. Anything from you? We have a space exhibit now. I can see that. Moonstone? What's so special about it? Alright, well... This seems like a good place to call the episode here, partners. I guess next time we'll start down the path over here to, um... Mount Moon? I think it's over here? Look at the town map real quick. Yeah, that's right. Okay. No, hold, hold on. I'm gonna try... There we go. Route 3, then Mount Moon. Okay. So that's what we'll be doing next time. I might actually buy some equipment off-screen. Probably get some, uh potions. There's going to be Zubats in there, so I might want to get some poison um, antidotes. I'm kind of tempted, well, I still have a few Pokeballs. I haven't seen some Pokemon I want to catch, but then if I um, have to take them off the team to put on the Pokemon I want, I'd feel bad for some reason. <laughs> so I'm going to wait till I uh, get the um, Squirtle, Bulbasaur, and Charmander before I start filling up the team or catching more. There we go. Three antidotes, I'll be fine. Uh, what else could we see in there? I might grab a couple of Awakenings and a Paralyzed Heal. We won't be seeing any fire type, so I don't need a Burn Heal. Uh, escape Rope might come in handy. I'll buy one. Oh, I can't afford that. Never mind. Went and wasted all my money. I can't remember, but I think there was something else around here I could get. I th did you give something, or... I remember something about... A, uh, was it Repel? Do you know what I'm doing? Yes. That's right. It's hard work. Oh, wait. No, no. Hold on. I think he gives a Repel. I might... Might be wrong on that. I'm spraying Repel to keep Pokemon out of my garden. Oh, okay. Alright. Well, then, I guess this is as good a place as any to call the episode. Next time, we'll head down Route 3 towards Mount Moon. Thank you, Watson. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, partners. If you enjoyed, feel free to click like and subscribe. Much appreciated. It really helps me out. I will see you, partners, next time. Thanks for watching. Get, get, get out of the way. Let me just finish off the conversation. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.